Hey everyone and welcome to this GitHub tutorial. In this video, we will explore different ways to download the files from GitHub repository. Whether you want to download individual files, directories or entire repositories, GitHub provides several methods to suit your needs. Before we begin, make sure you have a web browser and an internet connection. You don't need to have a GitHub account to download files, but having one can give you additional options. So, so first method is downloading individual files. So first of all, navigate to the file. For that, open the GitHub repository in your web browser. Browse through the repository to locate the file you want to download. So for example, in the source directory, in the app directory, I would like to download the app.component.html. So click on the file name to view its content. On the file view page, click on this small little download raw file button. If you click on that, it will trigger the download and it will save it in your computer. So once it is saved in your computer, you can open it and use it. Second way is that you just click on the raw and it will open the file in the in raw format in this way and here if you simply click on the if you click right click on it click on save as then it will ask you to save the file so give it the location where you want to save it and it will be saved now let's discuss the second method that is downloading directories so for that we need to navigate to the directory so open the github repository in your web browser and browse through the repository to locate the directory you want to download so let's suppose i want to download the source directory okay but uh, unfortunately github doesn't provide a direct way to download the entire directory through the web interface however you can use third party tools or browser extensions to download directories as zip files so one popular browser extension is git zip for github available for chrome and firefox so let's install that extension just to demonstrate that this so search for the git zip chrome extension in the google it will give you the link on the top just click on that it will take you to the store and here you can see the screenshots showing us how to use it okay now click on the add to chrome click on add extension this extension would be installed once it is installed so right uh, click on that and pin it so that it could stay visible that is not compulsory by the way to pin it now uh, re refresh your page and here i want to download this source directory so select that and as soon as you select that you will see this arrow that is saying download checked items if you click on that it will download all of the checked items and give you the zip file you can see just click on the save button and that folder would be saved so once it is once it is downloaded click on that it would be extracted and you can double click on that and you will see all of the files are downloaded now let's talk about the one last method that is downloading entire repositories so first of all navigate to the repository open the github repository you want to download in your browser and now we will download the repository so on the repository's main page locate the code button near the top right corner that is in the green color click on that in the drop down menu click on the download zip option the repository will be downloaded as the zip file to your default download location so let me pick the downloads folder and hit the save button okay you can see that entire repository has been downloaded i have clicked on that and it is extracted so double click on that and you will see your entire project has been downloaded so if you are using mac os then you can just double click on the zip folder it would be extracted automatically but if you are in, if you are not using mac then you can use third party softwares like 7zip or winrar there is another alternate method that is cloning the repository if you have git installed on your computer you can also clone the repository 
using the command line this method allows you to obtain a local copy of the entire repository in including its version history so for that open the terminal where you want to clone it so make sure you are in the directory where you want to clone the directory or uh, where you want to clone the repository now open the repository again and here click on this button and click on https or ssh depending on your system configuration for now i will just click on this button because i have configured my ssh already so i can use it so just use git clone and press end so it is saying that this uh, repository already exists so let me create another folder so that i so that i could download it there okay now let's run that same command again and you can see it has been downloaded it has been cloned now if you use cd command angular and press enter we are in that folder and you can see all of the files and folders within that folder you can now open it in your editor and start using or editing your code so these are the main methods to download files from a github repository choose the method that best fits your needs whether you want to download individual files directories or entire repositories remember to respect the license and terms of use of the repositories you download make sure to review the repositories readme or license files for any specific guidelines or restrictions if you found this tutorial helpful consider giving it a like and subscribing to our channel for more github tips and tricks i'm also working on a blog article version of this tutorial which i will add to the description once it is available so keep an eye on the description for the article link thank you for watching and happy downloading